Attention all very insolent pubescents. This game has Pamela Anderson in it. You know who she is, right? You like her in Baywatch, don't you, you filthy scum? That there, I'm convinced, is the only reason this game managed to make it on the shelves or sell any copies at all. This game is starring Pamela Anderson, don't you know? Because aside from the appeal to a specific mindset, this is barely what I'd call a game in the first place. This game disguises itself as an action-packed secret agent spy thriller thing, and aside from that premise, it does not give a single shit. You spend the whole time in VIP for the PS1 either performing the most basic quick time events in existence, or moving a cursor around a screen and clicking shoot while identical clones of random nameless individuals pop into the screen, and that is all you do in this game. You can't move or even get behind cover, you just stand in place and shoot other people who forgot they're holding guns and are supposed to be killing you, or you just stand in the middle of lifeless environments watching some of the worst PS1 model animations ever while you press two or three buttons at a time to do this. And despite the game being based straight off of a TV show of the same name with the same actors featuring some of the cheesiest and most enjoyable nonsense I've ever seen, what is Walter White doing in this? The game doesn't even care about capturing the essence of what it's based off of from the intro FMV sequence. Not only because your first client looks like if Elton John was smacked in the face with a spade, but because it establishes absolutely nothing. He doesn't tell you where he is, what's actually going on, why he's in this situation. You just go to his house and blast away until there isn't a single breathing specimen to get in the way of Pamela's jugs. And by the way, you have been called to get these suited guys out of the house, yet here they are inside the house. Not going for their target, they were supposed to be killing from the very beginning and going for you instead. I know movie and TV time games usually get bad reputations for being sold as cash grabs, but I mean... <laughs> What's VIP's excuse exactly? I hadn't even heard of this show until I first played this game nearly three years ago, so I can't imagine it just making money off of the name. There needed to be an actual game behind this if you wanted people to care. But then I suppose at the same time, that was kind of the point. The people who made this clearly didn't give a shit, so if they wanted to provide an experience to make the audience feel exactly how they did while making the game, it's a roaring success. <laughs> Do you feel like you need to wash your brain out after seeing some truly awful video games? Well then how about go to the description below to chrono.gg forward slash caddy where you can get a really good Steam game on the site every single day for a ridiculously cheap price. Be quick though, the offer only lasts a day and then it will change tomorrow.